been a minute since I've done like a full workout. So we're gonna do a fun workout today that's gonna be mostly legs with some arms in there, some core, some cardio. So it really, it's kind of like a full body workout almost, but it's gonna be intense and it's gonna be something that can be done at home or at gym. You just have to have the weights and the right equipment. So do it either way. And then you can challenge yourself as much as you want. <laughs> it doesn't have to be as intense as I'm doing it, but um, so yeah, so, ah, so I am starting. So I'm starting this with uh, my, um, my Stance BCAs. I always have this through my workouts, aminos to uh, protect and preserve those muscles. And Stance, shaker cup. And, um, <laughs> and it has coconut water extract so it gets extra hydrating while you're working out. So I might have had a little bit of coffee this morning, just a little bit. I actually spilled it all over my crotch this morning if you saw my Snapchat. It was everywhere. And I was wearing pink pants and thank God that the coffee, the, the brown coffee blended into the pink so you couldn't really see it. But I could feel it and I could smell coffee. So I definitely had coffee crotch. <laughs> Alright, let's go do this workout. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to start with first is getting two different sized dumbbells. So here I have 15 and uh, a 12. So, so the reason we're doing two sets is um, because we might need to change weight depending on the exercise. I know for some of my arm exercises, I'm gonna need to drop weight. And some of my leg exercises, I can keep a higher weight. So having the two options, um, we'll be able to, you'll still be able to get through your workouts and um, still have intensity like, or not be able to complete an exercise because it's too heavy. So have the two options and um, we're gonna start with the heaviest one first. So also remember, each circuit you have no rest in between each exercise. Until you complete all of them, then you rest. So each one is just, you move on to the next. Move on to the next. After you complete them all, then you rest. If you can help it. <laughs> Are going to have 
dumbbells on the shoulders again. The reason for putting them on your shoulders versus maybe having some to your side, it just creates more intensity and actually creates more weight onto you with the exercise. So coming from up here versus down here. So it just creates more intensity of the exercise, especially if you're doing it from home or you don't have access to a gym or something like that. Just by changing where you put the dumbbells will just take it up a notch. sturdy bench step whatever you have it can be even um, you can use a stairs you can use a step you can use a, a block if there's a block at your house or something like that um, an edge of something otherwise if you can't do that you can imitate it and I'll show you how to do it
sweating. Hopefully that workout kicked you guys' butt. Something new, something different. If you guys like this video, please like it. Please subscribe if you haven't. You don't wanna miss any cool stuff. Please share it too, if you like it. See you guys on the next one.